And while ASOs are assuring Waldo residents that they shouldn't see a difference in protection, last night's decision to close the police department is leaving many in the area uneasy. My name is Officer Timothy Logan. Well, I guess at this point it's, it's going to be former officer. By Halloween, Officer Logan and the rest of the Waldo City Police Force will get the last of their severance pay. January would have been my six-year anniversary. At least from the Waldo City Police Department. You either have a police department or you don't have a police department. At City Manager Kim Worley's recommendation, the City Council voted to shut the department down. Worley says the city simply can't afford to keep officers on the job, but that change means Waldo officers will take a big financial hit. It's not that we're voluntarily leaving. We're losing our jobs, and the financial burden of that is going to be great. Many Waldo residents say this decision is unacceptable. This is a small town, and but we need a police department, and I think everybody needs a police department that can respond uh, when someone calls and still have to come 30, 40 miles to get to an area. Though there's still some disagreement as to whether or not Waldo Police Department should be closed, there is one thing that everybody can agree on. For those residents who walk Waldo streets every single day, safety should be priority. The Alachua County Sheriff's Office says while they can sympathize with Waldo residents, they shouldn't be worried. Uh, there shouldn't be a disruption of service. Um, it'll now be a green and white and a deputy instead of a Waldo officer, but uh, you know those calls should be handled in a professional and, and courteous manner just like any of our other calls. The city of Waldo is currently located between two of ASL's patrol districts, and deputies say if need be, they will be restructuring those regions to fit Waldo's changing needs. The, the police department may have outgrown the city for a little while there, but Waldo is a great town, and I don't see them not having a police department for very long. I hope the best for them. And because of a previous agreement between the county and the city of Waldo is set to expire soon, ASL will be removing its interim chief from the Waldo Police Department at the end of this week. Rochelle Aline, WUFT News.